Yes, Christine, I know you are very familiar with this face. And frankly, after today, he is extremely familiar with yours. <laughs> You know, I wanted to make the world smile, like so, like I'm trying to do it any way I can, any way I can. <laughs> I've been doing these pumpkins since 2015. So you can see it's Christine's uh, face here. Yeah, I was in foster care for nine years, lived in over 17 homes. Very harrowing experience. The only way I survived that was art. <laughs> it's always an escape, right? I started drawing because I was jealous of my sister. She had one. Uh, art contest when I was around five. I was like, I want to, I want to win a, a prize. Ain't she a beaut? Oh, <laughs> that's a great picture too. Yeah. She has beautiful eyes. Oh, it's yeah. a secret to getting the eyes right. I mean, I really love people. You always connect to people's eyes. So like, eyes have always been important to me. I usually start with the eyes. So you're Santa Claus at Christmas. You carve pumpkins for <laughs> celebrities in your off time. George Clooney has Casamigos, and I did pumpkins for him for two years, along with. Of pumpkins, I do caricatures and puppet shows and face painting and balloons and you know MC stuff. The top one was Stevie Wonder. I started animating just like within the last four years. As silly as Jim Carrey was, it's like I could do that. <laughs> you know. <laughs> Fox 11 News Pumpkin Edition. You should do our voiceover. <laughs> yeah, I, I'd love to. I, I, I'm actually a, a pro voiceover a actor. What do you not do? <laughs> <laughs> Taxes. <laughs> <laughs> what does your sister say now? Uh, she's just proud of me. What would be your advice to people in, in this town? or When I teach my actors, you know, I, I, I always say it's not about you. Yeah. And it's easy to get swept up in the vanity of it all, especially if you're doing uh, some prominent work. It's going to live past you. Do good in the world, and, you know, why not do it with art? He got his artistic eye, actually, from his real parents, who he is estranged from. And after decades in and out of foster homes, he says he had so much anger bottled up, and it was actually art that ended up pulling him through. Alex, you're next, but he needed a little bit of extra time for all that hair of yours. <laughs> <laughs> That was nicely done, and I'm like, I'm so moved that you made that piece so much about me. What really, he's done so much amazing work. And Haley, we should post, <laughs> right? We should post on our page because he's done a lot of famous like pumpkins, Kobe Bryant, things like that. Snoop Dogg, Kanye West, and Kim Kardashian. I mean, he has done every top celebrity in Hollywood you can think of. And we are in an empty warehouse, basically. He used to shop in here. This was a Dollar Tree, and they get their pumpkins from up north and from Colorado. It's really an amazing thing that they do. They're kind of the middleman in between the pumpkin patches and the farms. And tell me real quick where those pumpkins are from. Oh, Mr. Jack-o'-lanterns. <laughs> yeah, we're, we, uh, we have some patches over in West L.A. and Torrance. And we've also been doing a bunch of uh, custom pumpkins for productions and, and uh, all sorts of stuff. Look at that smile. We need to put that on a pumpkin. All right, back oh, to yeah. you guys. Yes, we do.